politician and a lawyer are the more two devil roles in this country hmm. every hindi movie after 1960 70 <laughs> villain is either a lawyer or a politician <laughs> which is wrong has to change and i wear the both the hats <laughs> but oh jaji ki kehnde ke jaji na hi guys i am sid and i'm veera and welcome to another podcast episode of the balance part we have with us jayveer shergil paji who is a lawyer of the supreme court he is also uh, a spokesman a national spokesman for the bjp and he's also a tedx speaker we pretty listen to your tedx talk oh, it's very thank motivating you. the seven things and he's a lot of other things which we are going to kind of try to figure out and extract from him but before everything paji thank you for coming here thank, thank you thank you thank uh, you in honor i mean i've known you when i was a little kid yes i've seen you a little <laughs> like a little kid uh, jumping around in the lozenge i've seen you now you're a grown up married man i know right which like. doesn't make me very feel good about my own age <laughs> <laughs> and i am uh, Uh, like a uncle sitting between these oh, two young no, people no no at all but uh, amongst many identities uh, you mentioned my my most proud identity is that i'm a born jalandhar boy of course and jalandhar still resides within me wherever i am wow yeah. wow so my first question is going to be about jalandhar how was life growing up in jalandhar you started in st joseph and apj by the way the best school in the world <laughs> uh, how was it how was how was life growing up as a kid in jalandhar uh Firstly I'm a little biased about the school title so <laughs> I studied in St Joseph Boys School also till class 10th okay, okay. Uh, yeah. yeah and uh, APJ was 2 years okay and I'm biased between both okay because uh, your young years hmm. the formative years hmm. uh were there saint joseph girls school was only a little bit far away right so right, right. that's an important part to of mention course, and every point uh, jalandhar i went to that school oh yeah <laughs> so every jalandhar boy would know the importance <laughs> of the geographical uh, location the and the proximity to the school uh jalandhar vadiya si in the sense jalandhar um, the most important thing when i turn back mm-hmm. and cherish is uh, the friendships you make mm-hmm. Yeah, I've I live in Delhi for the past eighteen, nineteen years, partially mm. like a Banjara, Delhi, Jalandhar. We shuttle between. Right, right. They, but I studied in Calcutta, Berkeley. Mm. But the friendships I nurtured there, they are the closest to me, uh, unsubstitutable. Right. Uh, people here, especially maybe my friend circle, it's been nineteen years. They've not asked me what work do I do. Right. Uh, why do i do this wow. right. I, the conversation still rotates around when in on lml vespa scooter we used to eat 12 <laughs> rupees veg burger in model town <laughs> chili, uh, the chicken chili chicken pizza and that w wimpy yes, 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 yes. Uh, so the basic essence of life the flavors of life right. is, despite the fact we are at 40 Right. Uh, the mode of transport would have changed mm. we might have graduated from cycles to scooters to cars mm. right uh, but our conversation has not graduated from 12 rupees veg burger <laughs> what's going on mall town gedi route uh, what's latest in yeah. town uh, and uh, and how what next holiday we are going to plan mm. and how nonsensical our conversation <laughs> is going to be so jalanda breathes life into me mm. keeps me balanced keeps me grounded mm. second thing more about jalandhar is uh, again uh, the community living mm. uh, you go to big towns now i live one my daughter mm. i there is no concept of community you don't have a kid opening a door and running into a park right to play through different games around mm. right uh, we didn't have the gadgets mm. uh, i don't want to sound old and blah mm. but uh, <laughs> the basic art of playing with the basic toy basic sports basic friendships and i okay can they get thank my stars mm-hmm, that mm-hmm. i g- did not get exposed yeah to so many things because right. this generation we get burnt out mm. i thank god okay can they her umar nal every flavor of life mm. came with the age we grew right uh, right gedi route mm-hmm. right banking class mm. not doing well in school not doing well in school mm. <laughs> your parents taking you to other kids house saying uska bachcha itna acha kar raha tha tum kyun nahi kar rahe all that flavors classic, of life classic yeah, yeah, yeah. uh peer pressure hmm. uh community so zindagi da har flavor the small hmm. flavors of life i experienced jalan so it's been overall well and as i say uh, this is where i belong hmm. this is uh, where my roots are hmm. and this is will i where i will finally close my eyes and lay my head dead. wow yeah wow between yeah. all this you yeah. know what has stayed constant wmp ye le liya ga nahi hai band ho gaya ye wala kaun sa hai ye v wmp hai sudha hath ka but chalo a v wmp bhi mera i remember 
as a kid i don't know if you remember or not as we used to visit from the lousy to your house and the whole family is going to vee vimpi yeah and i remember like obviously coming from the lousy like a restaurant and like salami is or something i had <laughs> not heard of and this is a salami sandwich is like okay <laughs> was that so i remember going to that vee vimpi with you i don't know if you were there or not i remember uh ki kan de tanveer i remember yeah yeah, yeah. but uh, to see pata nahi he used to be like the cool guy <laughs> who used to be in his room Yeah. and he didn't have to come and uh, meet the guests <laughs> so he was like oh wo kahan hai wo kahan hai like you know when is this conversation ending <laughs> <laughs> but yeah i mean i okay that's amazing padit and like so like you said like i remember there was a park right in front of your house right there was a lot of like playing stuff happening were you also a lot uh, involved a lot in sports as a kid yeah wo ki na jack of all trades and master of none hmm. I think the sport part uh, was more to keep yourself busy. Of course, okay. in your heart, it is more to stay away from homework. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But when you, yeah, right, that is the larger part. Mm. That I did mm. not dream to be an a sports person, mm. and uh, it's my weakness or my handicap mm. or my incapability rather. Mm. Uh, where it, the dream was to just be out with friends. Sports mm. became an excuse to be out with friends. Mm. Uh, to cycle, to cricket, to squash, to gym, khana club, swimming, uh, <laughs> tennis, and वो उस पानी सारे ना तेरे भाई ते वो have those thick French fries over there, they are loose chips. Have those. So sports was a big part, mm-hmm. um, and I'm glad we uh, got to because oh honey, that it gave the basic essence. There is much more to life than your stereotypical life. You remember later on. Hmm. Uh, life burns you out very fast hmm, true, true. life has a tendency to have that pressure hmm. on you hmm. right. and you have to have the tendency to look out for that went out irrespective of the age hmm. right hmm. okay right yeah. okay can because till one point you control life and circumstances hmm. other point life circumstances control you right but these sports hmm. your hobbies hmm. your simple thing of music play whatever you like hmm. those things keep you alive more than hmm. the money and your ambition hmm. because ambition burns you out very fast true true wo kind of a choti capsule khani hai ya koi maza bhi lena hai or whatever the whatever hmm. the sin you want to com- right, commit right, right, right. you should commit certain sins hmm. which uh, keep you light hmm. keep your wings light hmm. keep you less burdened hmm. uh, uh, breaks your shackles of being trapped in a vicious cycle right. of life so yeah right. sports park sports ke liye right and that is the reason i was i was 16 and i started flying a plane wow the, i have a private pilot license holder and patiala pushpak we had these old planes mm-hmm. right. and so 16 i was when i did my first solo flight in patiala oh wow yeah wow. so just wow. another method to keep me alive that's it is you, is do you still fly i have my private pilot license is very active okay and uh, when i was uh, doing my masters so i started learning in patiala but it, i had a break because that college and life to mm-hmm. go over but i completed in the us but I, yeah i still fly okay, and I, nice. i keep my license alive and active okay, yeah. wow really nice. yeah how did you get into that like how, did you know th- of this existence of this flying club ithe jalandhari uh, in the army got in the army she's oh, right okay. my dad was a ncc cadet oh uh-huh. jado purane time Thiki. in ncc you had the option you could learn how to fly a plane right wow uh, just like that just like <laughs> that. <my>. all <laughs> ncc cadet <laughs> So my dad, when he was uh, when he started practice, oh, they mm. you only had two seats, and one at the back was like a chota store room type, like it's a small plane, like uh-huh. a trailer. So he used to put me at the back oh seat. Oh my god! Okay. And tell her fly, you know, Just let's like go that, fly. Like, yeah. Kizal bhai, chal yeah. <laughs> and uh, put it me in this, and that got ingrained in me. And he said, you know, you have to do this. Second thing, why I did it at a very young age, I always like my dad always said, have a different story to tell. Wow. Okay, right. There will be so many kids who'll pass out from tenth, eleventh, twelfth, and I'm not putting fly. You can be anything. You can learn how to make pottery. You can learn how to do gardening. Right, I'm, right. You can do anything, hmm. but right. you should have a different story to tell on a table. Right. Hmm. Beyond what others are not doing. But right. flying, I was something I grew up watching hmm. Top Gun like hundred times. <laughs> the new one I've already watched fifteen times. <laughs> okay. uh, so the right. boy in me it does that. Right. Oh, flying like chaska pe gaya uh, from a young age, uh, and then four thirty in the morning go to Patiala, fly, come back. So that's how I start getting into flying. Nice, yeah. nice. That must have been something. That like, sounds that like a age. wonderful. It sounds like an experience. Like yeah, yeah. The know. noise of a plane, the wing, and the sitting in the cockpit. Mm. The feeling is unbeatable. So how long did you sorry have to okay. learn how to fly to actually at sixteen fly a solo flight? So flying, how it works? Whoever is interested. So if you're good at it, in the first ten hours you can do your first solo flight. Okay. Achha. Yeah. So the they, they test you. Mm. Can I put you on the plane? 
just right. for a one round or something mm. right and do it but you have to have minimum 60 to 70 hours to get your first private pilot basic license okay. people okay. do it between 70 and 100 hours to Take give you an answer hmm. then you have to clear a theory paper Right. India, there's a requirement. You have to have physics, chemistry, maths, oh. right. which right, I right. uh, did very badly in APJ school. <laughs> there. Made it. It's embarrassing. But I did take, took uh. it to for my flying license. Uh. Otherwise, I would have done arts Achha. or whatever commerce. They owe 60, 70 hours of flying, hmm. theory paper, and hmm. that's about it. And people who train commercially, they have to do 300 hours plus. Oh, they have to like fly yeah. for longer. Yeah, yeah. Fly for longer. So, like in terms of like pressures from home, है ना जितना करते हमेशा कहने के like you said your father was always care have a story to tell a different story to tell in terms of academic pressure was it there when you were a kid the pressure was never there to top uh, okay <laughs> the pressure was there not to be in the last two okay. <laughs> so it was somewhere a mid game uh, right and uh, pressure was there when i went to law school it requires 50% passing marks in class 12 hmm. right uh, but i think the pressure from home academic pressure and we me and my brother both have been very lucky was you know not to be a failure hmm. right hmm, hmm, hmm. and have a sense of discipline where you don't think take things for granted true hmm. it's not that somebody is going home and somebody koi ni kaka homework rehan de right hmm. koi ni kaka school jana rehan de hmm. right koi ni kaka teacher hi galat hai hmm. so those basic values were reversed for us you had to do your homework not to top to have the discipline hmm, hmm, hmm. respecting your teachers respecting your house help respecting right. attendance right hmm. right you know for a little fever or something ke yaar ja hmm. and uh, so we and so that we are light and my dad ensured hmm. that again we were living our youth childhood according we got the video games at the time hmm. right we right. was made to show tv right we were allowed to do gaddies right we were also allowed to compete so all flavors of life right. okay but on a lighter note my hmm. dad told me three things hmm. ek to tere karke thane na na pe number 1 नंबर वन नंबर टू मैनू तेन किसी ड्रग डी एडिक्शन सेंटर ना ठीक है नंबर थ्री आई डोंट हैव टू चूज अ गर्ल फॉर यू सो दीज थ्री थिंग्स राइट स्टे अवे फ्रॉम रेस्ट ऑफ स्कूल दैट इज वेरी कूल है it That's also like way. takes me back to like uh, while i was growing up things were very simpler very similar to yours and i feel like it was um, like the pressures of uh, doing well at school was not there it was like do well but also have the other values in place like you mentioned yeah. like respect people mm. around mm. you don't treat people like you're better than mm. them or bigger than them or like you know like i remember mm, uh, i went to st joseph's so lots of people came from like everybody came from a very different um, socio economic background so my parents would always tell me that oh you know if you went like you went to hop for a holiday for your summer vacations maybe there are children who don't get that opportunity to go for a holiday so don't start going to school and like boasting that i went here and i went here so i feel like those values are um, now i see kids um, growing up um, i'm sure you're a father i'm sure things are very different yeah, with yeah, when yeah. you see your kids growing up cuz like i have friends with toddlers and their toddlers are way, i'm like this is a very sharp child like <laughs> if i was like this when i was younger my mother would have given me two backs mm. so yeah things are different but i think i think all times are good mm. and it's important to move uh, with agreed with stay humble right stay humble I mean, stay humble do yeah. everything but stay humble yeah but you want me i'm sorry but i'm still in that plane <laughs> yeah i'm also in that plane i actually want to know <laughs> about the like if you have like a um story to tell us about your flying mm. which like really like when you basically sit with your friends in jalandhar mm. and you talk about a flying story tell us about one of the stories that you discuss like a like a funny thing ha- that happened so i have um, uh, like I, and I, my grandfather used to fly planes and my dad tried in the middle um so they have like some really funny stories where like land nahi ho raha hai plane ya like something <laughs> funny like uh, something like we've heard like uh, crazy yeah. crazy stories so uh, i'm sure there's something uh, no see the two or three <laughs> things you know flying clubs <laughs> right uh, they are a world of their own <laughs> right 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 so equal flying club in andar kadam rakh so it's a runway hmm. khuli zameen obviously hmm. and it's a, a hangar like right. a oh hangar where all the right. ਕੁਰਸੀਆਂ ਲੋਕਾਂ ਨੇ ਡਾਈਆਂ ਹੋਈਆਂ ਕੁਰਸੀਆਂ ਬਾਹਰ ਬੈਠੇ ਆ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਰਾਈਟ ਰਾਈਟ ਹਾਂ ਤੇ ਸਾਰਾ ਦਿਨ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਤਾਂ ਸਵੇਰੇ 4-5 ਵਜੇ ਉੱਠ ਜਾਣਾ ਫਲਾਈਂਗ ਵੈਨ ਯੂਰ ਲਰਨਿੰਗ ਇਟ ਇਜ਼ ਵੈਰੀ ਵੈਦਰ ਡਿਪੈਂਡੈਂਟ ਰਾਈਟ ਆਈ ਕਮ ਟੂ ਦ ਸਪੈਸੀਫਿਕ ਸਟੋਰੀ ਬਟ ਆਈ ਵਾਂਟ ਪੀਪਲ ਟੂ ਹੈਵ ਐਕਸਪੀਰੀਅੰਸ ਪਾਇਲਟ ਜੋ 
ਉਹਦੀ ਪੂਰੀ ਦੁਨੀਆ ਉਹ ਕੀ ਕਹਿੰਦਾ ਜਾਨ ਐਂਡ ਜਹਾਨ ਇਸ ਦਾ ਫਲਾਈਂਗ ਕਲੱਬ ਓਕੇ ਦਾ ਫਲਾਈਂਗ ਕੁਰਸੀਆਂ ਡਾ ਕੇ ਬੈਠ ਕੇ ਬਦਲਾ ਵੱਲ ਦੇਖੀ ਜਾਣਾ ਯਾਰ ਵੈਦਰ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਵੈਦਰ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਅੱਜ ਆਧਾ ਘੰਟਾ ਫਲਾਈਂਗ ਮਿਲੇਗੀ ਵਿਲ ਆਈ ਗੈਟ ਟੂ ਫਲਾਈ ਫੋਰ ਬਿਕੋਜ਼ ਇਨ ਅ ਡੇ ਯੂ ਓਨਲੀ ਗੈਟ ਫਲਾਈਂਗ ਫੋਰ ਐਨ ਆਵਰ ਐਟ ਐਨੀ ਐਨੀ ਫਲਾਈਂਗ ਸਕੂਲ ਓਕੇ ਓਕੇ ਵੈਦਰ ਡਿਪੈਂਡੈਂਟ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਮੈਂਟਲੀ ਟਾਇਰਡ ਔਰ ਵਾਟਐਵਰ ਰਾਈਟ ਇਨ ਉਹ ਜਦੋਂ ਫਲਾਈਂਗ ਕਲੱਬ ਜੋ ਗੱਲ ਹੀ ਸਵੇਰੇ ਸ਼ੁਰੂ ਹੋਣੀ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਮੈਨੇ ਇਤਨੀ ਪੇ ਲੈਂਡ ਕਰ ਰਹਾ ਥਾ ਉਹ ਮੈਂ ਉੱਪਰ ਗਿਆ ਵੈਦਰ ਖਰਾਬ ਹੋ ਗਿਆ ਮੇਰੇ ਕੋਈ ਏਟੀਸੀ ਨੇ ਕੰਟਰੋਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਦਿਆ ਕੋਈ ਕਹੇਗਾ ਮੁਝੇ ਮਿਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਰਹਾ ਕੋਈ ਕਹਿ ਰਿਹਾ ਯਾਰ ਮੈਂ ਬੈਂਕ ਕਰ ਰਹਾ ਥਾ ਕੋਈ ਗੱਲ ਸਾਰੇ ਮੁੜ ਕੇ ੜ ਕੇ ਗਾਣੀ ਜਹਾਜ਼ ਦੇ ਪੱਖੇ ਦੇ ਆਸ-ਪਾਸ ਹੀ ਘੁੰਮਣੀ ਠੀਕ ਸੋ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਵਨ ਇਟਸ ਅਮੇਜ਼ਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਵੈਨ ਦਾ ਵੈਨ ਵੈਨ ਦਾ ਵੀਲ ਲਿਫਟਸ ਫਰਮ ਦਾ ਰਨਵੇ ਐਂਡ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਅਪ ਇਨ ਦੀ ਏਅਰ and uh, suddenly the things on the ground the sizes start reducing and you know they become tiny dots those mm. tiny, and that that wind blows on your face it's amazing it's mm. airplane uh do two sunny one is a show off story and uh. one is a genuine story <laughs> pushpak as a plane your viewers can google uh. oh e tusi kadi army da shakti maan da truck dekhya uh. haan ji why is shakti maan popular as a truck mm. shakti maan ch- kise bhi prakar da they are war ready you can hmm. put a petrol you can put a diesel you can put a kerosene okay so shakti man is a tail dragger uh, samne kuch nahi dikhta hmm. so the interesting story was when you are on a pushpak when you are right. on a runway and when you push the throttle hmm. so so you have to do like this to see the runway is clear oh, or not oh. <laughs> and the plane also goes and right. it, you have to be very quick on your rudders on your uh-huh. feet and when it lifts then you see ਤੇ ਜਦੋਂ ਦ ਇੰਟਰਸਟਿੰਗ ਸਟੋਰੀ ਵਿਚ ਐਵਰੀ ਪਾਇਲਟ ਵਿਲ ਰਿਲੇਟ ਟੂ ਜੋ ਯੋਰ ਇਨਸਟ੍ਰਕਟਰ ਨੇਵਰ ਟੈਲਸ ਯੂ ਦੈਟ ਟੁਡੇ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਡੇ ਯੂ ਵਿਲ ਫਲਾਈ ਸੋਲੋ ਅੱਛਾ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਨਾਟ ਮੈਂਟਲੀ ਪ੍ਰਪੇਅਰਡ ਫॉर ਇਟ ਰਾਈਟ ਦ ਸਟੋਰੀ ਇਜ਼ ਯੂ ਅਪ ਅਸੀ ਰਨਵੇ ਤੇ ਵੀ ਆਰ ਦ ਇਨ ਅ ਪਲੇਨ ਟੈਕਸਿੰਗ ਇਟਸ ਕਾਲਡ ਰਾਈਟ ਬਿਲਡ ਦ ਰਨਵੇ ਰਨਵੇ ਇਨਸਟ੍ਰਕਟਰ ਸਡਨਲੀ ਓਪਨਸ ਦ ਡੋਰ ਐਂਡ ਗੈਟਸ ਆਫ ਦ ਪਲੇਨ ਐਂਡ ਆਮ ਲੁਕਿੰਗ ਵੇਅਰ ਆਰ ਯੂ ਗੋਇੰਗ ਇਟਸ ਅ ਟੁਡੇ ਇਜ਼ ਯੂਰ ਸੋਲੋ ਡੇ ਜਾ ਔਨ ਦ ਰਨਵੇ ਇਨਸਟ੍ਰਕਟਰ ਗੈਟਸ ਆਊਟ captain kang he uh, any flyer in punjab would know captain kang god bless his soul he's not there with us anymore but ke tu ja hmm. right uh, just like that just, just like, like that, that. Hmm. and you push then or you are all on your own <laughs> and practically as in ye part mein you are sweating from every possible part of your body <laughs> ke you are up in the plane right te ke kuch panga pe gaya this is the last time fir pure har khayal thonu aanda when you are up in the air what is going to happen Right. Mm-hmm. So when you're bringing the plane, I remember on my solo, mm-hmm. there comes a point when you said, "Bhagwan bro, say, hun mm-hmm. apne aap hi lalu, apne aap." Na. <laughs> In the sense, when you're really, really? the mm-hmm. most difficult part is landing. Landing, the plane. Yeah. Right. right. So that every story a pilot will relate to about his first solo, right. how right. his instructor got off, the anxieties, the curiosity, yes. whether you'll be able to get that big bird back in on the ground mm-hmm. or not. Right. second is a show off story this is a bigger show off point for me <laughs> i used to be in berkeley doing my l and berkeley is on the uh, right on the ocean right bit. so and the flying club was little far away you would take your friends sorry hmm. uh when you would come over the university and say they come up apni upar university ke upar fly karke dikhata hu and you would call them before the take off listen i'm going to fly just right. wave wow. at me <laughs> right so right, right, right. Uh, these are the stories which you take back from flying club you have bad weather stories right you have show off stories <laughs> you have an anxious curious stories mm. right. uh, you have certain trick stories which i should not say on the camera right, <laughs> right, right, right. that's pretty much but it gives you the confidence mm. it right. gives you a confidence if you can fly that machine and right. plane for your viewers it's not like a car Mm. there are thousand things happening to you at the same time is mind body coordination mm. like f1 driver mm-hmm. you have to talk to the air traffic control right you have to look at your instruments mm. you right. have to look at your weather mm. you have to keep your eye out mm. uh, mm. everything it's a amazing hand body coordination i know there's a cluster of like instruments ah, like kai ah. dial dual je hunde and the smaller the plane mm. the difficult is to fly oh. of course you have to be trained now higher planes have autopilot right take right, off right. kita button the bear koi autopilot no no button the bear and off you go it you're constantly yeah, you are you are involved with that machine wow yeah it's quite uh, nerve wracking <laughs> what what a great hobby to have to be honest great hobby good and that's why a lot of kids you say in america and i because uh, sare majority 90% people who are training in america right. in aviation sector are indians oh okay philippines america australia so that's yeah the, the reason being pa but jada ek
other nations it's very flexible i can sit in the plane make a call to the tower i'm flying and yes, off sir. you go right okay. you don't need thousand those permissions that, yeah. it's 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 hmm. painless tez karke bachche it's more faster more availability of flying instructors better infrastructure so hmm. that's the reason so when you was flying at 16 didn't you want to make that your profession tujhe kya idda nahi socha ki you'll become a commercial pilot or was it just a hobby hobby you were very clear yaar mainu na monotonous zindagi pasand nahi hai okay that is one thing i cannot see myself in one role as a result i'll show you another story and 2006 is when i graduated from law school hmm. right uh, calcutta in ujs yes uh, i got a on campus recruitment because my dad had flatly refused i am not getting into your job you have to figure it out yourself okay <laughs> yet another condition that we are never working together my dad is a lawyer acha i know, I, I, yeah, know yeah. i know that we don't share Achha, the same yeah office space ever since i've graduated right and he was very clear on that uh तो वो मैं निकले सो आई स्टार्ट वर्किंग फॉर अ लॉ फॉर्म सो आई हैड अ रूटीन अ लॉ फॉर्म जाओ एंड आई आई वॉज नाइनटी के जीज दैट टाइम सडनली इन अ ईयर आई पुट ऑन लाइक एटीन के जीज ऑफ बिकॉज इट्स अ डेस्क जॉब लॉ फॉर्म सवेरे जाना और लंच या पैक कर लेना कार चकनी आई वॉज ट्वेंटी वन ट्वेंटी ईयर ओल्ड गेटिंग अ वेरी गुड सैलरी जाना शाम को घर आ जाना सौ जाना सवेरे जाना शाम को घर आ जाना सौ जाना and one day i was going on the road i said should will i be justifying my life if i'm doing this throughout my life and then one day i saw abhishek singh he is india's top lawyer rather world's now highest paid lawyer arguing in mm. court i said i want to be him i joined his chamber randomly i got 1/10th of agar 100 rupaye kamare se utha jaake main 10 rupaye kamare se udda hi rajneeti ja ke hmm ki yaar can i cannot be doing only this hmm when i close my eyes i cannot justify that i was just a lawyer वो कोई ना कोई पंगा ले ही रख दिया जस्ट बिकॉज आई हेट टू बी इन अम नॉटनेस थिंग राइट इफ आई एम डूइंग पॉलिटिक्स आल्सो इज बीन नाइन इयर्स आई एम अ स्पोक्स पर्सन नाउ आई एम शिफ्टिंग हेविली फ्रॉम मीडिया पॉलिटिक्स टू ग्राउंड पॉलिटिक्स दैट्स द अटेम्प्ट आई एम मेकिंग राइट बिकॉज कंप्लेसेंसी कंफर्ट लेवल मेक यू लेजी राइट राइट एंड जो व्हेन यू सेड प्रोफेशन आई लव एविएशन एंड एंड सी एवरीबॉडीज लाइफ सरकमस्टेंसेस डिफरेंट ट्रू आई एम सेंसिटिव देयर आर सर्टेन पीपल हु डोंट हैव चॉइसेस इन लाइफ राइट you have to be very cautious you have to be very aware you have to be very sensitive mm. uh we were lucky and blessed enough our we could be a little bit more adventurous with our life oh sada tukka lag gaya ek to baad ek cheeza hundi rahi hai so that's pretty much about it so my itch to different things right is more to do my hatred for being monotonous right right so how did law come into into the whole scenario why why did you end up doing law i was not intelligent enough for any other course <laughs> <laughs> no I want to be a lawyer always <laughs> same mere wale <laughs> same in the sense ke engineering never excited me I was a okay. very pathetic student if I can't tell you my marks on <laughs> physics chemistry maths <laughs> I could like barely barely skim through it till 10th I was a great student mm. 11th 12th you know uh, life had a different vibe and phase of life mm. in jalandhar right. became a typical so called I shouldn't be saying a so called apj boy acha uh, <laughs> jalandharite food हां एवी सड़का दे लूरो लूर फेरी जाना सारा दिन गेड़ियां दे गेड़ी दे गेड़ी ये हो गया इधर कर ली उन्हें कर ली पीपल विल से पीपल स्टार्ट स्प्रेडिंग स्टोरीज और व्हाटएवर एंड बट इंजीनियरिंग नेवर एक्साइटेड मी आई वाज ऑल द थिंग लॉ इज वन एक्साइटेड मी बिकॉज़ आई सॉ माय फादर ग्रोइंग आई सॉ अ थिंग इन देन लॉ स्कूल व्हेन आई स्टेप्ड इनटू लॉ स्कूल एंड आई मेट लाइक यू सेड इन सेंट जोसेफ आई मेट पीपल फ्रॉम Calcutta from Asan Sol to Kerala to Kochi to Hyderabad to mm. Jammu Kashmir mm. all it's like a melting pot so mm. many cultures you're rubbing shoulders right Calcutta taught me the basic value what education should mean for you mm. how there are schools in other parts of country and how our schooling lacks behind right. i don't want to make an unpopular remark here mm. and we will talk about it how education for a typical person a child or a boy growing up in jalandhar has a different meaning to education to other people people mm-hmm. right how our role models are entirely different and wrong right than right. other yes, people right. 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 right how other people other na parts of the school we talk about train you to excel and think beyond money hmm 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 and how here education is only tied to a myopic vision of money Right. right and that's the biggest disc- uh, we'll talk about it hmm. biggest uh, factor ke jo calcutta ja ke when you said hmm. and i speak it i am lucky 
to speak at many universities and mm. not to show off or anything mm. which i would have never thought of mm. jalandhar pade pj gay national law school you know i've spoken at harvard kennedy school at columbia okay. stephen zavier's you name it mm. and track to dialogues and uh, we feel blessed but the point is in our state and this is a mindset we have to change mm. when our kid goes to education largely it is that salary or how much money will you earn correct your next role, role model is ke land cruiser hai hmm. itne kille zameen hai ya ye hotel hai ya ye boutique hai ya ye marriage palace khol liya so kid thinks do i really need education for this right very right because is education for them education means owning certain things hmm. then you Correct. get to a, your class 11 12 you join a factory you do your basic whatever the course right. because the end goal for you is survival and money Hmm. True, but when I did my education abroad uh, in Calcutta, in educa- education is much, much more than that. Owning those cars, the boutique, the marriage palaces, the factories, or whatever, mm-hmm. it opens your basic vision. Basic vision: how to respect a woman. Hmm. Basic vision: how to respect a, 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 a civil society norm. Hmm. Basic vision: uh, to think beyond. Uh, money and money becomes a byproduct basic right. vision to read better basic vision to judge people better basic vision to know th- about things to push your b- boundaries right. so mai hamesha kehna honda ke i am proud of my roots hmm. this is where i belong but i travel also but one thing it has told me the canvas of life is very big hmm. right right let's not close our vision be myopic by judging it from a jalandhar level hmm. right. or any level any city hmm. right Money is a byproduct. Hmm. Right. Excelling in education will get you that. Right. But please Correct. don't judge it by that. We need right. to de-link these two things. And please have better role models uh, than any uncles and aunts or anybody or any politician or anybody. And I'm not judging anybody. Hmm. Right. Uh, who you see that their success is only measured by the things you own. Hmm. Correct. Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. Yeah. Like like you, like, like, you know, like what Sen Bolt said. and people that either one day wonder what he said behind my 16 years by behind my overnight success hmm. is my 16 years of hard work right so keep that in mind is sorry you were saying right. something no i was saying that yeah absolutely relate to it like i went back to the time when you were saying this that yeah while i was growing up like there was nothing at least the environment of school that i went to like i was i was i think i was good at school but i was not um, like i didn't want to get a 90% like yeah. i was okay getting that 70% but also doing 100 other things mm. but i feel like yeah like the ultimate goal was like oh we have to study hard so that we get a good job so that we earn a lot of money and mm. so that we don't uh, you know ba- we basically live a comfortable life yeah. but yeah i think um where you come from is that you don't want to sit i feel like um, when you say that you get bored i feel like it's more about how you realize at that point that this is not enough and i must do more because i'm capable of more and i feel like that is something that should be taught in a mm. curriculum around us because i think that is uh, what is lacking that constant like ek ek hota hai na when you set up a business and you sit back because you're like ha sab kuch kafi hai enough hai sab kuch aa raha hai maza bhi aa raha hai और क्या और क्या क्या जरूरत है वाई वर्क हार्डर वाई वर्क हार्डर बट आई फील लाइक दैट यू नो दैट दैट इच और दैट यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू लिव दैट मोनोटनस लाइफ और दैट इच टू बेसिकली दैट आई एम बेटर दैन दिस और आई कैन गेट मोर इज आई थिंक आई डोंट थिंक दैट इज कैपिटलिस्ट आई थिंक दैट इज दैट इज नॉट आई थिंक दैट इज लाइक जस्ट टू ग्रो एज अ पर्सन यू नीड दैट जेन जी लोग You only live once. You only live once. I learned not the Gen Z. My daughter is going to have to catch up. And you only live once. And in YOLO, uh, it's it's uh, okay. Because Punjabi, khade da khalsa. Then ja ke jee onde ane mail. Mail le. Right. And you have to feel that have you experienced enough? And I told every kid. I said, go please experience. How is it to to bunk a class? Right. Hmm. You know, up to the red line and drug and be an addict or something <laughs> for sure. But experience. Uh, uh, how to bunk a class right experience other things which are important in your growing right. up age and uh, experience yes also be grounded to reality look up at the sky but keep your feet grounded hmm. into your roots and be aware of your reality right that right. you you love to experiment right. you want to be artist you want to be a poet uh you don't want to write poetry right. you want to draw canvas or whatever the whatever you want to do but keep in mind there are bills to pay too 
Right. So keep that balance alive. Right. Absolutely. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Absolutely. I think, uh, honestly speaking, like uh, our current educational system is still very bent upon teaching people how to make money and equating things with like materialistic things around us in terms of ke. आप बन गया जी वो बन गया लाइक कितना सैलरी लगूगी एंड लाइक हाउ वॉज यू सिंग यू सिंग इट्स इट वॉज डिफरेंट इन कैलकटा लाइक डू पीपल नॉट थिंक दैट वे इज ओवर देर हाउ डू हाउ हाउ डू दे थिंक एंड हाउ डिड दैट हेल्प यू काइंड ऑफ ब्रेक आउट ऑफ दैट कुकून ऑफ केयर आप बनना है आप है कमाने हैं सी आई थिंक देर आर टू थिंग्स देर आर मैनी पीपल इन आर नेशन हु डि नॉट गो टू स्कूल बट दे आर डूइंग वेरी वेरी वेल फॉर दम सेल्व इट्स ए कल्चर इज ए वैल्यू इट्स वेदर इट्स इन फील्ड ऑफ पॉलिटिक्स और बिजनेस आई एम नॉट सिंग इट्स अ प्री रेकोजिट टू बी सक्सैसफुल बट इफ यू आर ब्लैस विद एजुकेशन जो तुम कह रहे हो कि एजुकेशन सिस्टम हाउ इज इट टिलटिड हाउ इट इज टिलटिड इज बिकॉज योर करिकुलम इज के रट्टा मारो जी यू ग्रैसप राइट रा दैन अप्रीशिएटिंग थिंग्स अराउंड यू you grasp you excel that you will get into a top university if you will get those cut off marks that, that's a good sense of competition i'm not mm-hmm. saying that but the structure in your schooling is books ratta vomiting it out on a, a final paper pa- on yeah, a paper right this needs to change mm-hmm. and to turn into a be- better human being mm-hmm. your education has to be with your more skill development mm-hmm. your uh, more ethos about your inni uh, asi kitaban padde na i don't want to sound like a gyan guru for no, a no, second please, please moral like a mo- moral science di jehdi book hundi hai sab to choti hundi hai bilkul theek hai bilkul it's like a 10 pager or yeah. a whatever right. 100 pager oh sab to zaruri cheez hai oh civic uh, uh, civics ha hmm. history civics history civics geography uh, and uh, puri, moti, moti. you know you have those those important hmm. but the basic moral science is the least hmm. the education has to be tilted to train you to do better how is it better you told me yeah. when you we you go to the schools and lot of schools mm. there's a equal on books there is a equal uh, uh, force that you have to be a better sports person okay there is a equal uh, impact on importance on sex education mm. which is mm. very vital very important. there is a equal impact that you have to be a good debater you are pushed and exposed to Uh, other mm. debaters there is right. equal push that if somebody loves the rock music mm. uh, equally there are rock festivals being held mm. somebody loves the punjabi music mm. uh, you have equal uh, emphasis there should be on punjabi music jo ek bacche de shauk hai a there should be a space to let them try it them and right. then make a conscious choice mm. the fact that you are in a sport or a music mm. or a painting cannot be a taboo mm. it right. cannot Bilkul. be a bad thing ke nyana kuch karda hi nahi yeah yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. right it, it has to be a, a fine balance between your studies mm. here the school curriculum the infrastructure ask yourself how much school building space is given to hosting kids as a business and how much is a playground in it mm. right there should be more emphasis on uh, outside then the more emphasis in our university was how will you get a job on your own mm. uh how uh, like we were sometimes allowed to write a uh, uh, even in berkeley mm. i could write my exam mm. from home because the institution trusted me i will f- be ethical wow. and not cheat. not cheat right and they gave me that space that was a learning right. you feel ashamed sitting yaar mai ek bar khol ke dekh la but then you feel you know am i really doing mm. so basic training of ethics wow. living your dream you might fail Hmm. but the infrastructure should be supportive of that hmm. right right hmm. right it should not be only supportive of pcm or commerce hmm. ke apa apj gaye te ek building hmm. tap ke naal di dooje college pahunge bas hmm. inna tak mera safar si right hmm. you may make that choice there is nothing wrong in it hmm. but then you should be exposed to other choices right, right. i think schools in jalandhar especially should get maximum people from outside hmm throw different role models at a key from a rock star to a punjabi music star to right. somebody who's recovering from drug ad- addiction right. to a top lawyer to a top politician to a top right. hotelier they should be exposed to all to of everything. these things right it should be a cherry picking you know right. a cherry picking farm hmm. you pick some good cherries it should be like that and you throw the bad cherries hmm. right let the kids listen to every aspect and let them pick their own good and the bad cherries that makes so sense that's pretty much wonderful it. That yeah beautiful wow. i actually <laughs> want to ask you as a as a person going as a young boy going from st joseph's <laughs> to calcutta right or uh, after apj yeah. after apj i mean i know that um, i know that the exposure is not a lot like yes you get exposure through your family through the friends that you meet and but it, you're still a little submissive you're still a little like 
thoda thoda dar hota hai when you go outside yeah, yeah. the world because the outside world is very scary yeah. initially for that sa- the the simple person from st joseph's and apj what was your fir- like what was that feeling the first time you entered university um like was it overwhelming what, like it now of course like see you're blooming <laughs> <laughs> but like i know that that blooming and blooming <laughs> cuz i know that no, initial that's my happiness to be here <laughs> nothing to do with my life successes okay <laughs> with two both of you <laughs> and your lovely team behind the camera <laughs> thank you so much bhai thank you go on so like what was it uh, it must be a little overwhelming the first time going stepping into that environment because i remember that i it took me a while to like when i went from a small city to uh like from jalandhar especially like i felt like i didn't know anything i went to sanar actually for 2 years that ta- gave me a little bit of sense little bit not a lot that's also like a bubble by itself so um i won't really call that uh, very a uh, very holistic uh uh, uh introduction to in the uh, real world uh, real world environment because when you go to university like there are different things that are thrown at you so uh, I how think, how is it like no it is overwhelming in because we are uh, we were molly coddled at home you don't live in a hostel right. you get whatever you want on your plate true you have the roof on your head right you don't have to worry about laundry or the basic toothpaste and the toothbrushes right yeah. you can make that random request you feel like eating right mm. आज ये नहीं खाना राइट बट हॉस्टल लाइफ इज अ मस्ट आई से बट आई एम वेरी बायस्ड आई से इट इज मस्ट आफ्टर क्लास ट्वेल्थ लॉट ऑफ पीपल गो डू इन यंग एज इन स्कूल बट ओके देर आर टू द गुड बैड एंड द अगली एज अ मूवीज द गुड इज वेन यू गो फ्रॉम अ स्मॉल टाउन लाइक जलंधर यू ब्रिंग अ लॉट ऑफ वैल्यू एडिशन ऑन द टेबल राइट बिकॉज यू हंगरी फॉर दैट एक्सपोजर एंड देर आर सर्टन बेसिक वैल्यूज विच विक टाउन स्टिल डोंट हैव योर फ्रेंडशिप्स योर कम्युनिटी लिविंग योर लुकिंग आउट फॉर ईच अदर योर सेंस ऑफ अप्रिशिएटिंग एंड स्माइलिंग इवन एट अ स्मॉल थिंग एट अ न्यू ओपनिंग ऑफ अ न्यू पिज्जा स्टोर राइट ऑन अ न्यू सी डी स्टोर यू गेट एक्साइटेड लाइक अ किटन ऑन अ टिन रूफ राइट यूर जम्पिंग अराउंड लाइक अ किटन ऑन अ टिन रूफ सो दैट इज अ वैल्यूज यू ब्रिंग आउट योर ईथॉस इंस्टर्नली योर वेरी स्ट्रॉग दैट इज अ गुड पार्ट ऑफ इट the bad part of it is it's not about jalandhar i had people and you know our accent is different hmm. people in cosmopolitan there if you go from in you know everybody speaks in a different vibe i had students who brilliant in their minds but they were very shy because they were they never spoke english in school hmm. there was not a via media of uh, lingo right they spoke hindi or bengali or a, a south indian so they start feeling a bit intimidated Right. You have to be okay that you know. Yeah, so English is the only thing. You're not cool enough if you don't speak in English. Right. So the first hurdle is you cross that. Right. Some people wanted to learn English as you must. Some people got more comfortable on this scheme. So one is the cultural adjustment. Right. I remember going from Jalandhar. I was wearing a so uh, the gold bracelet, <laughs> and everybody looking at what's going on here. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> like uh, uh, you know, and then I realized which was cool maybe back home. <laughs> It may not, not be cool here. Yeah. <laughs> and he like. Why are you guys sounding? Are you like a <laughs> you know singer in, in, in uh, what is going on? It's not cool. <laughs> and and random you're talking about oh that alloy wheel. Uh, and he's like, huh? The conversation life is not about alloy wheels. <laughs> right, right. Right. You dress right. in a certain way, right, uh, right, which right. may not be cool in some part, hmm. uh, but it's cool in our town. Uh, yeah. yeah. Not that that. Yeah. Just get better on your skin, <laughs> right? Uh, you love, so basic things you adjust. Uh-huh. Right. and uh, three thing culturally which you said you feel a eh, of course you miss home hmm. right ek main wo army da jo trunk jo hunda i took that trunk hmm. you sit down you break bread with your fellow countrymen from different parts you learn the value of a 100 rupee toothpaste or a brush or correct uh, you have a budget to live in right hmm. when you say it's overwhelming hmm. uh, you get homesick sometimes you feel intimidated with other kids who are like speaking fluently right english is no barometer of knowledge i'm like i am a proud i sometimes i go and speak punjabi you know f- and i feel proud of it hmm. right. you know of, of a room full of academicians and intellectuals or something hmm. i love it right but that's a confidence in the sense you get over the years right hmm. so you feel intimidated it's not your culture then you start choosing your friends who may judge you it's mm-hmm. a coed a university you want to impress certain people mm-hmm. uh, how will that pan out <laughs> so your life blooms mm-hmm. right you start adjusting right for me it 
taught me the importance not to be a tribal not to live a tribe living not it's called tribalization mm-hmm. that is not that I, i can only hang around people from uh, jalandhar or mm-hmm. like you know i was hanging around people from bengal yes. calcutta yes. It, it gives me a lot of education uh oh gaye kai pange bhi lete uh i became the president of the student union okay and all that just happened uh i met my wife in law school back then oh. and uh so that was good part and i was uh, in calcutta pers is a very cultural city right mm. the is. conversation still over a 5 rupee or a 2 rupee tea happens over marxism communism mm. uh, right uh, against capitalism uh, you you are trained to think you may choose any ideology you want mm. right you're trained to, to think, think beyond the mobile phone the alloy walls the sone ka bracelet <laughs> and uh, uh, the factories or whatever it is the, the parameters of your life change right so that was good and there was a part and they became your life my the fact of walking into each other's room mm. sharing a common bathroom mm. right uh, living in a budget right uh, getting humiliation of not being in the top and not getting recruited some people felt that mm. right. the peer pressure the sports the fights wow. uh, so you you need to get a few bruises as they say on your hip and a lip mm. to learn different experience of mm. life so yeah it's good wow wow amazing important is to step out <laughs> yeah. yeah i think it's it's really important to get out of your comfort zone mm. and experience these experiences i'm like like literally when you're talking i'm like visualizing <laughs> yeah so i think I'm everybody like, okay. went went i'm like chai pe chai pe baat kar rahe hain anti capitalism ki like full full like <laughs> wow so wow this that was very well put paji so after blooming in nujs you then went to delhi to start practicing how was that how was that experience was it difficult finding where to work and like adjusting eventually to you know now from this college life suddenly now you you know kind of grasti cha gaya like na so was it difficult it was an i got a on campus recruitment okay a uh, lot of law schools national law schools are lucky that will hmm. we get a lot of recruitment or oh, first pay check of your own Wow. feels like uh, an accomplishment feels like an accomplishment hmm. and punjabi udna hi pagal hunde hai 100 rupaye kamaye te assi assi cheezan de kharch de ne and i did the same i used to let's say 100 rupees if for 80 rupees i buy the car and my 80% em i used to go in the car <laughs> because my dad had the house and i didn't have to worry about the rent in a very right. shallow sense of the word right. but oh fir panga punjabi ke da hoya jinne paise waste nahi kite exactly pange nahi lete right you know uh, we and punjabis and savings are a to alien concepts that's true uh, uh, agreed agreed मोटी चमड़ी जज ने धजियां उड़ा देनी it also i think for your young viewers it's important ke we decide to early be open right mm, ke mujhe law karni hai to mera jeevan agar law kar liye jeevan hi law hai law hai ji mujhe doctor karna mai doctor hi hu maine hotel kholna mai hotel hi kholta rahunga ji. i think we make these decisions very wrongly right please join a workspace even if no matter who your father mother is uh, or not you're not lucky or you're lucky enough feel what competition is feel by what is being humiliated by your bosses it's right. very important right feel when a client has to make you wait for 6 6 hours hmm. feel when you have to miss certain occasions in life to be at your work hmm. and i don't say that you should continue do that hmm. but you should experience all these things right see whether you like this or not right i was in america when hmm. i was doing my masters in law i had 
people who are 52 53 who suddenly decide okay now is the time we want to do law right Haan, yeah so yeah. Law. yeah right A, be open to it so right. whether it's your workplace uh, and ask you is this what i meant am i meant for, meant for mm. right and uh, uh, but also keep aware about your commercial realities as the hindi saying goes mana paisa khuda nahi par khuda ki kasam khuda se kam bhi nahi that is the right. reality kitna hai ji pura wo rakhna so workplace treats you discipline hmm. teamwork theek hai humiliation hmm. uh, uh, importance of excelling hmm. importance of earning money, money. Hmm. importance of uh, exposure to other things for new opportunities hmm. for tin saal oh kam kita for hmm. one fine day i left my job joined abhishek singh we then i went mm. to uh, america that's the next chapter of my life mm. paji you worked for 3 years in delhi mm. and then how and why did you want to drop your job and then go to do your masters how did that get into your head uh one a serious answer one son one a non serious okay. answer <laughs> of course again the one thing again i wanted that see as a get, life at certain levels is game of illusions and exposure both mm. एक इट सी के आर इफ माई माई फादर वेंट टू गवर्नमेंट स्कूल इतने जलंधर ठीक है जी रेलवे स्टेशन देखो ओके एंड ही वेंट टू अमृतसर इवनिंग लॉ स्कूल उदो जो तो लोग लॉ करते थे ना इट वाज द लीस्ट कोर्स देर अ जोक एक लड़का कोई कोई पीपल गो फॉर टू आस्क फॉर अ हैंड इन मैरिज ऑफ समबडीज डॉटर एंड इट वाज अ प्रैक्टिकल जो तो माँ बाप पूछते थे हाँ जी क्या करते हो वो कहते मैं वकील हूँ वो कहते वो तो ठीक है पर करते क्या सो दैट वाज लॉ टुडे लॉ हैज चेंज टुडे अ न्यू किड हु ग्रेजुएट्स फ्रॉम अ लॉ स्कूल इज अर्निंग फ्रॉम अ गुड लॉ स्कूल इज अर्निंग वन पॉइंट स्टार्टिंग सैलरी एंड दर्ज लॉट ऑफ मनी फॉर अ ट्वेंटी वन ईयर ओल्ड बट जो तुम्हें मैंने when i wanted to go out hmm. a i needed that break okay one two i needed to have a exposure of a a, 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 a different university education system hmm. english british system is very good in law american system is again a very different different vibe teesra ek mor vi lwani si to sound that cool of course right. and it to feel a sense of pride in the, you know i went to oxford or a cambridge or a berkeley right. did right. that uh, so when there Hmm. class of 70 students from 60 different nations right hmm. and uh, you go there education system was very different in america hmm. uh, every day students are protesting in berkeley right there are police helicopters on daily basis hmm. on top of the campus hmm. somebody is excelling in uh, music somebody uh, has been nobel prize winner somebody right. is burning uh, books to protest right uh, somebody is uh, uh you know a 50 year old man has just enrolled hmm. there to start his life afresh right wow. uh, so or did that made some world famous professors hmm. side by side did my flying start learn sailing a little bit wow, oh, wow. Uh, my mex friends from south america onna to thodi modi modi me tor maran li spanish sikhni shuru kar di in but my stay there hmm. uh, again taught me how much i'm attached to my roots मैं बर्कले पढ़ने गया एक साल से तीन बार इंडिया वापस आया अच्छा जी बिकॉज आई वाज सो यूज्ड टू माय कैलकटा लिविंग इन वी आर कल्चरली वेरी डिफरेंट विद द बेस्ट एंड आई एम प्राउड ऑफ इंडिया दैट इन इंडिया यू कुड वॉक टू माय फ्रेंड्स डोर फोन करके हां भी क्या कर रहा है आ जा राइट रात नु दरवाजा कुंडा खड़काता ते चलो वी इनसाइड यू नो लेट्स ऑर्डर समथिंग आउट देयर लाइफ इज अ बिट लोनली इट इज you know you have to take that appointment right. bro today is weekend or not a weekend as i say even right. in the university life mm-hmm. so lovely amazing people one of the best friends i've made in my life but oh community living hmm. sense hmm. nahi hai our life here is not held hostage to a monday or a friday hmm. right if i want to meet somebody i want to have a banter or a hmm. joke yeah. uh, right in and i being a politician i love people i love hmm. the community living i can't eat alone hmm. candid confession like if i have a lunch or dinner i need some people around gap shop ho jaye o utthe nahi hai utthe nahi hai ha right mm. that's my love for politics i want to excel my mm. my uh, my my i've tied by the uh, umbilical cord to my roots mm. and to the people and the community living the gap shop the uh, that that brought me back many times to india right and i was very clear this i'm here for a limited exposure mm. to have that one year break Right. to imbibe as much knowledge as i can hmm. to experience different cultures as much as i can right. hmm. to be a silly and foolish in your youth at some time hmm. it is very important hmm. right. and oh tick mark karne hai to chalo mod batana mod batana so three education systems from st joseph apj to calcutta and then to berkeley berkeley 
So was and then to different university to speak where I could have never otherwise got admission. <laughs> Wow. Yeah. How was that experience? Like, was did this happen when you were studying in Berkeley? Were you called to different universities? This no, after. this happened when I joined the political oh, spectrum. Okay, okay, right. So right. I sp- I keep an active interest in track foreign policy, track to dialogues, as we know. Hmm. So people who are not uh, track to dialogues is people from like jade uh, political class, so jo pr- ministers aap nahi hai, hmm. intellectual journalists from. one nation they interact with people of other people of the nation right so i speak a lot of places get mm. invited for these track to dialogues right. from uh, israel on counter terrorism nice. i've spoken to nato headquarters in brussels right. on the security systems mm. uh, to colombia on the digital uh, digitalization of the economies and the cyber security space oh over ek darwaza ki kehnde tukka hi lag gaya there are many more people more, much more intelligent to me so i got into that space when i was in the congress party mm. so there are people in india are enamored by youth in politics especially from non political families nobody in my family is in politics oh pehla pata nahi i don't know how come uh, stephen called xavier called then kennedy school called uh, then columbia called and mm. then different universities started calling talk about youth in politics talk about digital space counter terrorism mm-hmm. india pakistan all different issues right uh, oh fir in a cell again clue mm. because you know you are always looking foreign mm. policy in indian politics is not nobody votes here except pakistan hmm. on foreign policy right hmm. for a politician you'll feel uh, i thought that's a space where i should capture uh, you start writing on foreign policy right oh loki bulan la pe and you go and it's it's mind blowing as a as a kid from jalandhar hmm. as they say money can't buy everything hmm. and when you stand in that kennedy school or in india at xavier's or a stephens hmm. where i could never get the marks to me <laughs> in right. you know, interacting <laughs> that feeling is unbeatable hmm. wow Wow, so you always had this in your mind that you're going to come back. Ah, pura. Pakka sir, I mean, and if you get a good opportunity, you'll get it. Then we won't get it. Can they make a president? Banjo, America's the rule. That was the that was the only way you could. <laughs> that have. was the only. That was the only. Okay then. <laughs> <laughs> But how how were you clear? Like I want I'm asking you from the perspective of young children in Jalandhar and Punjab today. and also around india who are bent upon the fact that, that they want to go abroad ke itthe kuch nahi hai yahan kuch nahi hai aur future acha nahi hai punjab ka india ka whatever we want to go abroad settle there because things are they say the grass is green on the other side so how how was your mindset very bent upon coming back and how do you think the youth should approach the same scenario i think every nation goes through a transition hmm. point 1 point to everybody's own circumstances are very different you can't compare an apple to an orange mm. there might be a some youth here in punjab who is struggling to make the both ends meet was not privileged enough to go to a school or a education and but has the skill mm. india unfortunately uh, as a transition lot has changed Hmm. uh may to give you first answer hmm. why did i Haan because ji. i was very clear law and politics hmm. right. these two f- fields are booming and blossoming in india hmm. and i love the people around so i was very clear i didn't have to come and pay anybody's debt it right. gave me the freedom hmm. there right. might not be other people might not be lucky but having answer you transition ho rahi aise hmm. since 2014 and i don't want to talk about politics look what happened till 2014 there were only 700 startups in this country mm. right san francisco silicon valley was the was place, place if you want to be a techie right and you want to have a new idea and you want to live the classic american dream mm. now from 700 today we are at 84000 startups wow 84 unicorn which means a billion dollar valuation yeah, one in 10 unicorns which happen in the world one is in india or two are in india right you had only 60 biotech startups mm till 2014 or 15 today there are 8600 wow. biotech startups a lot is changing in india giving an incentive for people to stay back mm. right mm. uh infrastructurally mm. opportunity wise mm. uh, startup culture the make in india and all the different schemes it's luring people to come back right mm. the other side which we must be very cautious about in our state our states for some of suffer from very peculiar problem we are landlocked mm. industry is at all time low it's more cheaper to get a good from a chinese port to a gujarat port and from gujarat to export to punjab uh, it is more expensive hmm. it industry didn't flourish here yeah. universities are here more on a wholesale factory business than modeling thing number 3 a skill development hmm. opportunity if you want to be drive a taxi you want to drive a truck of course the money is much better on this uh, abroad 
ਹੈਵਿੰਗ ਸੈਡ ਦੈਟ ਹੁਣ ਕੀ ਹੋ ਗਿਆ ਜੋ ਮੈਂ ਦੁੱਖ ਨਾਲ ਕਹਿਣਾ ਇੱਕ ਕੀ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਆ ਕਿ ਇੱਕ ਦੌੜ ਲੱਗ ਗਈ ਆ ਇਟਸ ਅ ਹਰਡ ਮੈਂਟੈਲਿਟੀ ਆ ਫਲਾਨੇ ਦਾ ਮੁੰਡਾ ਗਿਆ ਸੀ ਕਨੇਡਾ ਬੈਠਾ ਤਾਂ ਅਸੀਂ ਵੀ ਜਾਈਏ ਜ਼ਰੂਰ ਜਾਓ ਜ਼ਰੂਰ ਪਰਖੋ ਆਪਣੀ ਉਮੀਦਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਆਪਣੇ ਕੀ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਆਪਣੇ ਖਾਬਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਜ਼ਰੂਰ ਪੰਕ ਲਾਓ ਪਰ ਹੈਵਿੰਗ ਸੈਡ ਇੱਕ ਦੌੜ ਦੇ ਮਗਰ ਨਾ ਲੱਗੋ ਇੰਡੀਆ देयर ਇਜ਼ ਲੋਟ ਆਫ ਓਪਰਚੁਨਿਟੀਜ਼ ਰਾਈਟ ਰਿਐਲਿਟੀ ਹਾਸ਼ ਹੈ ਇਸ ਸੋ ਮੈਨੀ ਆਫ ਦ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਬੋਇਜ਼ ਆਰ ਸਿੰਗ ਲੈਂਗੁਏਜਿੰਗ ਇਨ ਮੈਕਸੀਕੋ ਜੇਲ੍ਸ ਇਨ ਮਾਲਟਾ ਸੋ ਮੈਨੀ ਡਾਈ ਸੋ ਮੈਨੀ ਗੈਟ ਲਾਈਫਸ ਗੈਟ ਸਪੋਇਲਡ ਰਾਈਟ ਰਾਈਟ ਕਬੂਤਰਬਾਜੀ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਪੀ ਏਜੈਂਟਸ ਆਰ ਡਿਊਪਿੰਗ देम ਥਿਸ ਨੀਡਸ ਟੂ ਸਟਾਪ ਨੰਬਰ 1 number 2 youth again i'm coming back to the point hmm. if our education system changes i like the prime minister saying if we give more importance yeah. to skill hmm. Hmm. you don't have to be a astro uh, nasa scientist or anything uh, you can be a good plumber hmm. you good that you need to have good wages you need yeah. to get oh sara kuch karna mainu lagda hai ke uh, jaise ke keh raha hai ke you know it takes two to tango hmm. uh, the system in punjab needs to improve a lot to lure our next generation to stay back Right. to show them the real life time examples hmm. the families pinda de pind jede khali ho rahe hai needs to realize life is better in india hmm. life is changing in india right uh, everything that glitters is not gold hmm. kai mundeyan di pare munde tabah ho gaye bahar ja ke hmm. there are people who have not seen their family for 25 30 years right yeah uh, they are uh, either be deported de- deported or they are that angry that they ke i think in any situation kharab nahi hai the amount of migration hmm. we just need to show them a better picture right. and they need to realize ke canada passport ya america di more lo aake zindagi sirf better nahi hai we have the capability we are doing much better right. and we should stay when i hope it changes hmm. because right. the demographic dividend of a country is a strength and yeah. we are losing out on that yeah. right Absolutely. if bangalore can do it if karnataka can can be it hub hmm. if himachal baddi can be industry hub, industry hub yeah. Yeah. why not punjab yeah. right. political class needs to think harder hmm. uh, the families need to think harder right hmm. and uh, of course drugs is a very going big problem loki bahut loki drug karke bhej dende yaar itthe kharab na ho jande bahar bhej de ha ji bahar bhejna koi jadu di pudi nahi hai zindagiyan utthe bhi bahut kharab ho ji exactly especially for girls hmm. Uh, so many girls uh, uh, on broken promises hmm. duped into marriages right ke ek sapna ja ke theek hai matlab main darshaka nu kehna jana hai and i don't want to koi why you know i am blessed to roam around koi utthe inna vadiya nahi hai that we have to hmm. we have a lot in india we should take a pride in india hmm. please go out for a good education if you feel like hmm. right please look out for opportunity thoda utthe dil lagda zarur raho but Thank india you. has changed hmm. we have a lot of potential hmm. and our political class in punjab also need to work extra hard to ensure hmm. that they have something to stay back hmm. right beautiful wonderfully put oh so baji uh, coming back from berkeley uh, politics happened simultaneously or was that like a moment where you were like okay hun politics wal thoda zyada dhyan dewange and law law still happens like you yeah, still yeah. practice properly like how the do you juggle and, the bread and butter comes from law acha uh, the school fees and the travel <laughs> happens from law <laughs> right politics is passion hmm. so is law hmm. but law is both necessity and passion hmm. dono se rakhna hai because i never want to have the greed or the temptation to make money from politics uh, so that my ideology and my core is not compromised dooji gal when you say ke juggle law puri i am litigating counsel uh, i'm act more in arguing cases and okay. and uh, uh, juggle karna of course uh, how did politics happen i was the president of the student union in calcutta right you mentioned haan ji to interact with people hmm 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 ke group ch baith ke bena at a selfish at a lighter level ke okay na pindan de you know in villages in punjab board da ped hunda hmm hmm board de ped de hetan loki bende hai te shaam nu gap shap puri panchayat di discussion so that concept attracts me a lot that's a separate the board ped into a calcutta hostel to thrash out administration issues to be a bridge between administration and the people sometimes to make the people understand sometimes to make the administration understand okay to make a small difference friends not to sound a cliche hmm. but to make a small difference in anybody's life and to feel the politics from a people's i love to be amongst people it uh, attracted to me like a magnet othon hmm. shuru kita then i started a, a legal cell in punjab all the that time i was in congress and people used to put false cases on congress worker to give them free legal help 
ਅੱਛਾ ਉਹ ਕੀ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਕੋੜਾ ਵੀ ਭੁੱਖਾ ਤੇ ਘਾ ਵੀ ਸੁੱਕਾ ਆਈ ਨੀਡ ਐਨ ਓਪਰਚੂਨਿਟੀ ਟੂ ਸਟੈਪ ਇਨਟੂ ਪੋਲਿਟਿਕਸ ਰਾਈਟ ਵਰਕਰਸ ਨੀਡਡ ਸਮਬਡੀ ਟੂ ਹੋਲਡ देयर ਹੈਂਡ ਦੈਨ ਆਈ ਗੈਟ ਇਨਟੂ ਕਾਂਗਰਸ ਥਰੂ ਟੈਲੈਂਟ ਹੰਟ ਪ੍ਰੋਗਰਾਮ ਅੱਛਾ ਜੀ ਇਨ 2013 ਓਕੇ ਵਾਟ ਵਾਸ ਸੋ ਦੈਟ ਟਾਈਮ ਦੇ ਸੈਡ ਮੀਡੀਆ ਫੇਸਸ ਦੇ ਵਾਂਟ ਨਿਊ 5000 ਪੀਪਲ ਅਪਲਾਈਡ okay from punjab my name was also said out of that 30 40 people became national media faces okay. after they were given 8 10000 pages to read uh, like a cat talent hunt without right. sifarish program right hmm. utthe aage that's how i started speaking on tv and election campaigning rally then i joined the bharatiya janata party hmm. that's a separate story why <coughs> so one door opened but ek fixated si hmm. like uh, arjun's uh, eye focus on the eye ke i have right. to do this right and you keep uh, you be a woodpecker hmm. kunda khadkai jao zarur kulluga kulluga can we get into why is the switching of the party of course, of course. Uh, switching of the party see i am congress gave me the identity as a politician and hmm. you, i cannot disregard and it will be very shallow of me to disregard that hmm. right but everybody joins politics with a purpose hmm. my purpose was of course a selfish purpose i love politics hmm. Uh, the larger macro purpose was i want to serve punjab the people and certain ideology mm. and i'm not saying one ideology is bad as other mm. but over the years uh, two things happened which disillusioned me from the congress party okay especially from 2014 19 onwards mm. mr rahul gandhi and the team around him has become extreme left ideology oriented which was never the congress's core i am not comfortable with extreme left ideology i'm not putting a question mark right uh number one reason hmm. number two in any organization you work in every politics has their lobby hmm hmm you have to hop in congress it became 80% which secretary and pa and officer on special duty and who's darbari who's pn you knew more than your merit 80% was your connection to the psychofancy gang around and 20% merit people who have consistently lost elections people who are consistently failed as in charges of states hmm. they are still given post after post after post because of the proximity to the psychofancy gang this disillusion me right for me politics is as i said ke koi do logon ke ghar hote hain ek jinke liye congress ghar hai dusra jinka ghar congress se chalta hai hmm. mera ghar congress se nahi chalta mera ghar congress tha bjp is very different is largely merit oriented you win election you deliver you will get a seat on the table right you don't need to know anybody secretary and ost because the prime minister and home minister themselves on a tent kursiyan aap layi hui hain hmm aap ja ke unna de know how politics right. works that is uh, the number 2 3 uh, and i respect madam sonia gandhi a lot till date par in punjabi ch ke di hai ke you know you should never work for a general of the army who himself is not interested in wins and losses ਮਿਸਟਰ ਰਾਹੁਲ ਗਾਂਧੀ ਉਹ ਪਹਿਲਾ ਫੌਜ ਦਾ ਜਰਨੈਲ ਹੈ ਜਿਨੇ ਤੋਪ ਆਪਣੀ ਫੌਜ ਵੱਲ ਕੀਤੀ ਹੋਈ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਯੂ نو ਲੈਟ ਸ਼ੂਟ ਯਰ ਓਨ ਆਰਮੀ ਫਰ ਯੂ نو ਯੂ ਨੀਡ ਟੂ ਰਿਸਪੈਕਟ ਯਰ ਸੋਲਜਰਸ ਯੂ ਨੀਡ ਟੂ ਮੋਟੀਵੇਟ ਯਰ ਸੋਲਜਰਸ ਯੂ ਨੀਡ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਹੰਗਰੀ ਫੋਰ ਅ ਵਿਨ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਵਾਟ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਸ਼ੀਏਟਸ ਅ ਪੋਲਿਟੀਕਲ ਪਾਰਟੀ ਫੋਰ ਐਨਜੀਓ ਆਇਦਰ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਕੈਨ ਬੀ ਅ ਪੂਰਲੀ ਰਨ ਐਨਜੀਓ ਵਿਚ ਕਾਂਗਰਸ ਇਜ਼ ਟੁਡੇ ਔਰ ਯੂ ਬੀ ਅ ਪੋਲਿਟੀਕਲ ਪਾਰਟੀ ਫਾਰਮਿਡੇਬਲ ਪਾਰਟੀ ਵਿਚ ਬਾਈ ਕਮਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਪਾਵਰ ਸਰਵਸ ਪੀਪਲ ਆਲਸੋ ਵਿਨਸ ਇਲੈਕਸ਼ਨਸ so these were my larger not no, to bore your audience no, no, no. Uh, reasons to uh, leave yeah. uh, ola social media the loki troll bahut karde hain that's part ahi nahi dekhe bhai koi troll te pa ji hun politics as as law happening there's lectures happening and we also saw on instagram that fitness is also happening so uh, how do you think and why do you think you are so passionate about giving those 3 4 days per week exercising and how does that help overall like what you do in life to stay fitting uh, fitted in my clothes and the kinne nave kurte pe hume and all the things you have to uh koi uh, politicians da na matlab jada mental hoya ke thode tagde tad nikle hoye but now i look at you like yaar matlab wo identities mere liye alag ho rahi hain ke nahi nahi there many fit politicians hmm. in uh, i think india ch udda vi fitness di aware bahut aa gayi hai in uh, for me i think it is more i have seen uh, a lot of unhealthy things are happening to a lot of at a young age mm. so that made me a as they say bad example serve as good warning signs mm. uh it gave me a scare you know you uh, bucket's destiny mm. that you have to remain 
ਯੂ ਨੋ ਫਿਟ ਇਟਸ ਯੋਰ ਬੋਡੀ ਸੋ ਐਜ਼ ਅ ਕਲੀਸ਼ੇ ਸੇ ਬੋਡੀ ਇਜ਼ ਯੋਰ ਟੈਂਪਲ ਇਹਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਸੀਂ ਰਹੀਦਾ ਤੇ ਇਨ ਯੂ ਵੀ ਅਬਿਊਜ਼ ਦਾ ਬੋਡੀ ਅ ਲੋਟ ਸੈਕਿੰਡ ਥਿੰਗ ਬਿਕੋਜ਼ ਆਈ ਵਾਸ 90 ਕੇਜੀ ਐਟ ਵਨ ਟਾਈਮ ਆਈ ਸ਼ੈਡ ਅਰਾਉਂਡ 80 ਆਈ ਨੋ ਦਾ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਸ ਵਾਟ energy levels and lethargy right. and laziness if you are pot bellied and you are not agile hmm. or right. you know what brings to you hmm. right teesra yaar fir main bada inspire ho gaya do teen actors to that they are age look uh-huh. at tom cruise yeah right. you know he is uh, he is jumping off the planes and uh, <laughs> look at akshay kumar hypothetically yeah. Yeah. the guy is super fit he sleeps right. on time and uh, but <coughs> i um my parameters are not to have some abs mm-hmm. or six pack of course anything. my parameter is that i can run i can jump i can play with my daughter mm-hmm. i can uh, you know uthan lage hai na karna pe in chautha most important is mai japan to bahut inspire hai okay people in japan only mm-hmm. eat in katoris in the bowl right. they don't right. eat in plates right kolliya right. ji khande hai mm-hmm. ਰਾਈਟ ਦੈਨ ਆਈ ਰਿਲਾਈਜ਼ ਦੈਟ ਵੇਰ ਡਿਗ ਐਸੀ ਐਮੀ ਦੱਬੀ ਜਾਣਾ ਦੱਬੀ ਜਾਣਾ ਚੱਲ ਚਾਰ ਸਮੋਸੇ ਵੀ ਖਾ ਲੈ ਚੱਲ ਛੇ ਰੋ ਯੂ ਡੋਨਟ ਨੀਡ ਇਟ ਰਾਈਟ ਈਟ ਇਨ ਅ ਕਟੋਰੀ ਈਟ ਇਨ ਅ ਕੋਲੀ ਈਟ ਲੈਸ ਬਾਈ ਆਈ ਮੈਂਟਲੀ ਯੋਰ ਐਪੀਟਾਈਟ ਇਸ ਸੈਟਿਸਫਾਈ ਵੇਕ ਅਪ ਫਰੈਸ਼ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਨਾਟ ਸੇਇੰਗ ਚਾਰ ਚਾਰ ਘੰਟੇ ਲਾਓ ਜਿਮ ਜਿਮ ਲਾਓ ਪੰਜ ਘੰਟੇ ਲਾਓ ਇੰਨਾ ਕਰ ਰੱਖੋ ਸਾਹ ਨਾ ਚੜੇ ਦੈਟ ਯੂ ਯੂ ਨਾਟ ਆਊਟ ਆਫ ਬ੍ਰੈਥ right you don't look like your granddad to your own kids grandparents <laughs> uh, uh, parent teacher meeting apne bachiyan de dada dadi nana nani na lago third uh, any warrior in any history book or any sports book health equally more than physical health is your mental health wow yeah physical health improves your mental health mm. and right. so does its vice versa vice versa you can have the best cars the best shoes the best clothes mm. if you're mentally not fit physically you can't enjoy them mm. absolutely right if you want to play this long game called life mm. you can't be burnt out to be agility to keep your agility like everybody has their down days mm. low days right uh, yeah. every sometimes you get out on a duck sometimes you are uh, sitting alone in a room that's right. a fact of life right uh, politics is snakes and ladder subsidies guy you're at 99 suddenly you're at 0 your right. yeah. dreams shatter in crash but to absorb all these shocks and observations hmm. uh, you need to be fit mentally right. and felt way thirdly as i said ke hunno utho te you know i have a fix jo thode shallow ke shishe mure khade hoye te lagge ya ya theek hai ha i think that's you know your last reality check that's the reality Best check reality yeah, check. yeah you know largely dekho, okay and uh, uh, like you are a biker and you are doing different things they hor pata lagge lati na utro bullet de upar pai ya whatever motorcycle de pai ha yaar badi lat chak right and khao har kuch khao measured cheezan ch khao koliyan ch khao japanese so khao te as i say if you want to sin throughout your life start sinning in moderation and that's the best part Beautiful. balance <laughs> i think i think i relate to paji by saying so we have also been competitive crossfit athletes oh, which I meant you, you look like both of you <laughs> <laughs> which meant basically training for hours and hours and hours 3 mm. hours 4 hours crazy and now it is more about like you said like we want to run jump and you know play with our kids or two beef kids <laughs> <laughs> and like i think there is long life and then there is longevity Yeah. long life if you're till 90 but after like 60 you can't even walk straight you need people to pick you up and take you to the bathroom that is not a long life i would want me or people around me to have longevity is the ability to have a long life but also be mobile in terms of being able to run go up a mountain not think too much no pains no aches joints are doing well so i think osa saab nal i correct i feel like um you're on the go all the time right like mm. you're yeah. constantly working you're constantly i'm sure like you're not sitting at home and resting like this too much that you have to go to and so i feel like the body a you can't over work out because uh, yeah. Yeah. you can't be like hi aaj maine legs lagayi thi par mujhe wahan pe chal ke jana hai or whatever mm. and uh, you know my body's hurting so like fitness just enough so that you can do whatever that you're yeah. doing in terms of what your work is uh, is very important um and also if you don't do it then of course like uh, the energy levels like you said yeah. are going to be very low so you will probably not feel motivated to even go to work yeah. or like do the things that you're doing so i feel like um, that balance is something that one should be striving for when yeah. it comes to and it's addictive it is it people is who want to work out it's very difficult for the first 7 days you hate <laughs> yourself yaar kithe panga le le kithe phas gaye right yeah you know but once you get used to it 
it's right. addictive that's why they some say called it's something called a runner's high people who run mm. they have a high right mm. right and uh, karo balance karo is fine i think ha- so how do you do it like um just just a very curious question um so i'm ge- I, i don't know what your uh, regular day mm. in your life looks like um but like when do you find cuz you are i'm sure very very busy throughout the day and mm. there are back to back meetings and you have to meet people so when do you find the time on a regular basis to like do you like wake up at earlier or you like i'm sure you juggle it out but how do you do it so i i am as i am growing old hmm. if i say the word uh my sleep pattern is reduced in college i could sleep till 2 in the afternoon hmm. Hmm. i mean do teen baje you so jana agle din 2 baje uthna right uh but now like i am i am my sleep breaks at 6 hours that's the max i can sleep right hmm. so day the best thing i love about my job in uh, the freedom i don't know uh what will i prioritize the next day there will be days my day can start as early as 3:30 and 4 in the morning wow and go till the midnight and there can be a day where i can be at my base and start at 10 11 matlab be i get up at 6:30 every day i read right. nine newspapers in the morning wow. okay. print please read print newspapers it's a dying breed that's a side note yes <laughs> and, uh, uh, please and uh, nine newspapers yeah. editorial you have to tweet you have to hit out at the opposition you have to tweet on policy that basic homework i get going by before 10 o'clock i right. eat breakfast by 8 8:30 um oh kar le da these are the basic thing with yeah. respect to what i am starting with sometimes right. you have to take a plane at 3:30 in the morning mm. or a train or whatever uh best thing about my job is some days i have to be at court at 10 and mm. be there till for do client meetings right other days sometimes i might be going to an obscure play. i might be you know i was speaking in tokyo ahead of the g7 on uh, indo pacific security right. but i hopped direct there from from japan to ga to jalandhar and speak on some uh, farmer issues oh. right. so the whole okay. variety and spice of life speaking it with boat i bandgala g7 on indo pacific nuclear security to speaking on farm wow. issues and policy issues in jalandhar right right and uh, Crazy. Uh, right so right. that's the what your how is your day three a goal set kita hai that in a week at least minimum 3 days of exercise hmm. if nothing is i have a cycle hmm. right. in the colony i pump it around in the cycle i have a trainer at home who comes okay, or right. i play tennis uh, worst case scenario like yesterday i was traveling could i completed my steps outside my house in badridas colony wow. for half an hour i uh, just climb so doing that kyunki uh, keep that clock or steps going step counter right if, if you want to do something you will find time right, right. if you value something whether it's your relationship whether it's excuse we give ourselves yaar hi hi time nahi mila yaar dost ko nahi phone kiya yaar kaam pe nahi gaya yaar exercise nahi if you value something right. you will find time for that thing that's the mantra i follow beautiful that's amazing beautiful. yeah baji yeah. so this was the physical aspect of your day of how you keep physically fit and what how much uh, how much of a priority is mental fitness and how do you take care of that because politics is like like you said memes and you have to take a dig at the opposition and then they return the favor and etc how do you kind of and, stay and, zen and also i would ah. like to add to this you said that you have to be thick skinned in front of a judge yeah. and yeah. you can't have your emotions going all over the place because you have to like think straight facts are facts so how do you maintain that zen i think when as i'm growing hmm. importance of mental health is growing more and more for me and you know you know it was a taboo that your if your mental health is not great and people and so many people have come out and spoken about it but map as a politician as a lawyer mental health ki there are two three three months a for our generation we should keep the stress to the lowest mm. Mm. there are highest chan- uh, increasing cases of cardiac arrest death heart attacks amongst young people and this right. is primarily because of the stress right uh second thing uh politics is a game of as i said snakes and ladders you get affected look i have a daughter and because of tv i uh, you know we i we get the rape threats that will rape your daughter a young child who's 8 year old uh, will kill you will do this you are a traitor whatever you're called names and then you have to be very aloof okay this is my work Ev- anybody saying is for the reason they might have that hate everybody's twitter handy and everybody sitting at home and becoming a warrior mm. and uh, uh, sometimes your aspirations your dreams get crashed you want to fight election you don't get a ticket you've been working at that dream for right. a bit so mental health miracle ek 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 mantra and i'm trying to practice it right that keep your stresses less uh, keep your basic parameters like okay i'm breathing mm. Mm. i have decent to pay my bills mm. uh, 
and then you there's a very very famous english saying that be kind because mm-hmm. everyone around around you might be fighting a tougher battle right. it's a very cliche but it, it holds well number 3 uh, jehde aas paas thode matlab jo system hai wo ek dastoor hai unna da lokan nu thonu tana to pull you down is a is a natural instinct right so when somebody is trying to pull you down mm. and you get pulled down mm. and then you realize that was your objective right fourth mm. uh, live life in short doses mm. we are burdened by our larger ambitions mm. now if i want to be burdened today oh i have become, i want to be the prime minister of country roz main kehta hi hi main pradhan mantri kad banunga hi hi main pradhan mantri ko if my short goal is okay these two amazing people siddharth and veera are doing a podcast i should be alert mentally alert so i wrote ke yaar jana hai that's my mm. short goal for today right yes. and uh, live life in small doses mm. don't burden yourself with such be realist about your ambitions but don't start a day ambition becomes your burden you will never achieve it so right. for your mental health uh, be alert shun your grudges be agile accept your mistakes mm. uh, if you're loud if you're rude to somebody accept it Uh, all ba- all balls need to be hit by four or six. Some need to be duck. Some need to bounces. Need to be left. Mm. Right, absolutely. It is good. Live, enjoy every season. Live life in capsules. To your judge point, mm. uh, again, it's very important. You know, uh, if you look at a cricketer or a top sports person, there is so much crowd. Mm. They have to play in that crowd. Mm. So you have to be focused. You are representing. They are representing India. I am representing my client. Mm. If my emotion can dissuade me. it's on this podcast hmm. if your objective was to have your uh, knowledge with your viewers or share some light moments ethe asi bas paye the objective of this podcast will go right. if in front of a judge i get angry or in front of a tv anchor i start abusing the tv anchor what i want to say for my party will go away hmm. absolutely take mantra ban lo jithe jana hai wo 30 40 second apni gal keh ke uthna hai hmm. and don't let that emotion right Uh, come in with the middle uh, uh, middle jeda kaam karan gaye ho oh karo oh karo don't hmm. over celebrate and don't over moan right and that is the middle part yeah middle but it's a hit and trial i think these are experiences which come from life right if right. some of your viewers are young and they're watching it in ha ek zaruri hai which is very important and a lot of generation is getting addicted to drugs hmm. that's escapism that uh, sometimes you feel the stresses and i'm um, everybody might have a valid reason jinna marzi stress ho jaye it's easier to get addicted or to take the easy route hmm. right agar jis din zyada kaam kharab ho us din bejo hmm. sit down hmm. reevaluate reassess don't be reflect don't be reflexive don't have knee jerk reactions to situations hmm. and uh, time will pass this too shall pass and this too shall absolutely yeah. absolutely kharab zaruri hai kande yeah. लीडरशिप इन वॉरी गुड few books are very very good definitely read uh, mahabharata hmm. and, uh, i would say that and this new book which has come out and everybody is raving about it i haven't read it it's called by matthew mccarney he has written a new book called the green lights green green lights yeah, and the and apparently is, uh, it's very yeah, good it's hmm. supposed to be very good uh, learn from his, so these are my three books hmm. leadership and war for sure hmm. uh, for anybody it tends teaches you trains you how to be teamwork and hmm. why you should be fighting certain battles and hmm. why you should not be fighting certain right battles. right uh, mahabharata is a larger good bad and it's interesting and the green lights i love matthew mccarney by the way yeah. <laughs> i have <laughs> maybe biased but i've been hearing good things i love him too yeah he's very good he's very good wonderful paji and also read a lot of newspapers because nine newspapers nine newspapers if i must read uh, nine point uh, that yes. out <laughs> read but that's my if yeah because digital age we are becoming a twitter happy generation yeah, 240 yeah, characters yeah. Right. a lot of fake news is going around mm. right uh, so newspaper trains your appetite that more than the headline content is also yes important. absolutely and uh, there are people might start a violent episode on fake news so it just trains you to read 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 Uh, and it trains you gives you listen don't trust everything you hear or see absolutely mm. figure it out for yourself so just clear that mm. nice and paji my final question uh, before we sign off what does the balanced path mean to you balanced path mean to me hmm. to stay alive happy kicking hmm. 
and fulfill my dreams and ambitions mm. and uh, not wake up with the regret god i should have done that right and, uh, so anything you do uh, if you think are uh, you going to wake up in a regret not doing it do mm. it today nice and uh, balancing lastly for younger don't go by others life examples mm. you can take the good but don't feel pressurized right a guy on a cycle may be happy but he may aspire for a scooter scooter mm. guy may even have a car car guy may aspire for a private jet private jet might say i want to go with richard branson up in the space this it's limitless limitless aspire right. be ambitious be content don't see the successes of others as a jealousy factor or a burden take mm. it as an inspiration if it work out everybody was not born to be a virat kohli Agreed. everybody is uh, is there to contribute their own mm. and be good be good be naughty <laughs> uh, balancely naughty uh, enjoy all flavors enjoy mangoes when it's mango season agreed challi khao jo to challi da mo nimbu sode piyo paave di kulfi exercise hi karo bilkul dabke khao dabke khao that's it dabke ash karo nice dabke khao dabke ash karo that's that's <laughs> that's your take away yeah. guys if you're liking this if you're loving our podcast please like share and subscribe i hope you are finding value from the information we're putting out and paji thank you so much thank for coming so in much. it thank was a you. pleasure it was a thank pleasure you. and <laughs> have a great day thank you very much guys thank you. this is veera and sit signing off